Welcome back on another video by Teaching Tube. After today's lesson, you will be able to differentiate between the genes, chromosomes and DNA. You will also be able to understand the structure of chromosomes. So let's start. For much of the human history, people were unaware of the scientific details of how babies got the characteristics of their parents. People had always thought that there was some hereditary connection between parents and children, but the mechanisms were not understood. Many answers to the questions about how offsprings get their characteristics from their parents came from genetics. Now what is genetics? Genetics is a branch of biology in which we study inheritance. Inheritance means the transmission of characteristics from parents to offsprings. These characteristics are called the traits, for example in man height, color of the eyes, intelligence, etc. are all inheritable traits. Parents pass characteristics to their young through gene transmission. Equal numbers of chromosomes from each parent are combined during fertilization. The chromosomes carry the units of inheritance called the genes. Now parents, they pass characteristics to the young through gene transmission. An equal number of chromosomes from each parent are combined during fertilization. The chromosomes carry the unit of inheritance called the genes. Now the genes they consist of DNA which contains specific instructions for protein synthesis. In order to know the nature and working of genes we will have to study chromosomes but before that I just need to summarize that the chromosomes they are composed up of DNA and proteins named histones. Now to study the structure of chromosome we need to go through this diagram. So chromosome is made up of chromatin material which is also known as chromatin. What is chromatin? So chromatin is a complex material which is made up of DNA and proteins mainly histones. So these red balls uh, you can see are proteins histone proteins and this thread like structures wrapped around these histone proteins is DNA. So DNA wraps around the histone proteins and form round structures called nucleosome. So this thread wrapped around this red ball is collectively known as nucleosome. DNA is also present between the nucleosomes. So you can see between two nucleosomes the DNA can be seen. In this way the nucleosomes and the DNA between them look like beads on a string. Now these fibers consisting of nucleosomes condense into compact forms and get the structure of chromosomes. Now the question arises that how does the DNA of chromosome work? So we will discuss this in another video. See you then. Bye and take care. And don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. Thank you.